food, food, food. It's like this is speaking directly to me. <laughs> it's the common element that unites humanity, brings us comfort, joy, and connection. This year, the University of Arizona's College of Social and Behavioral Sciences Downtown Lecture Series focuses on what feeds us. Lydia Brunig, Director of Community Outreach and Special Projects, is here to feed us more information. Oh, <laughs> like I, I can't take credit. I didn't write it, <laughs> but it was a good one. Good There's one, a Alex. lot of puns that come with food. Yeah. So tell us about this food series and, and why food? Sure. So uh, we're the College of Social and Behavioral Sciences, which you said very beautifully, but a lot of people struggle to get that off the tongue. So we call ourselves the People College. It's our nickname. We study people. We study people's connections to each other, to the world around us, and to our pasts. And food is right in the middle of all of that. Uh, food, we literally ingest our environment when we consume food. What's in our water, what's in our air, our soil, that affects what goes into our bodies. It connects us to our pasts. I discovered this the other weekend when I found a donut recipe from my great-great-grandmother, and my daughter and I made it together. And it was so powerful to have that connection to something from our past and our heritage and our culture. And then food connects us to each other. We gather around with family um, for celebration, for a cup of coffee, we meet with a colleague, a glass of wine with friends. So it really is something that infuses all of our daily lives. And we also have great faculty who do research on food. It is amazing. Our faculty lineup is simply superb and people are gonna learn a lot that they didn't know about food. I think this is great. We were just talking about that during the commercial break that, mm -hmm. you know, when you meet some, someone that's new, you automatically find yourself gravitating to talking about food and what you mm -hmm. like and, you know, your little quirks about what you eat. And somehow that's a safe, easy way to connect with people without getting too personal. Um, and so everyone at some point in their day goes, man, I can't believe how much we just talked about food. And now we're going to find <laughs> yeah. out why. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, food is truly something that tells us a little bit about ourselves. We think about clothing or the car we drive is saying something about us, but the food that we eat and what we prepare in our family gatherings also says a lot about this. And one of our lecturers is Maribel Alvarez, who's the director of Tucson Meet Yourself. She's going to talk about that in the lecture series, and obviously Tucson Meet Yourself is a great way to experience that as well. And why did the College of, of People decide okay. to bring the lecture series downtown? That's a great question. We were wanting to do this because we're, University of Arizona is a land-grant institution, so it's part of our responsibility to share the research and the information that we produce with the public at large. And a lecture series seemed like a good way to do that. So when we were thinking about where to do this, we could do it on campus, but one of our priorities for outreach for the College of Social and Behavioral Sciences is to reach out to downtown and help a downtown revitalization. We want to make downtown a place not only to work and to live and to play, but also a place to learn. So having the lecture series there made a lot of sense. And last year we did five lectures there at the Fox Theater. And every night, Wednesday at 6.30, people came out in droves. It was really wonderful. We filled the Fox Theater every night and we hope to do so again this year. And as the College of People, you want to get out to as many people as you can. So you guys actually even also live feed the lectures. That's right. Last year we started this in partnership with Arizona Public Media, which is our local uh, public television station. And they, we did it mostly as a, just in case, in case we had overflow. People could go to the TEP Unisource building, which is downtown, and watch the lectures there if they weren't able to get into the Fox Theater. Well, a lot of merchants ended up doing, picking up the live broadcast, and people who are wandering the streets, kind of grumbling that they couldn't get into the Fox Fox, um, would pop in there and watch them as well. And so we decided to strategically build on that. So not only are we broadcasting in downtown, we're broadcasting to Green Valley, Oro Valley, uh, downtown Phoenix is going to pick up the live feed. So the people who can't come downtown can still have that social experience of gathering with others to learn, to have a conversation around something that they enjoy. And, you know, we're just extending our reach through that. And we're very excited about that. And we were, we were talking about how you're having it at the Fox Theater. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us how, how can we get tickets? That's a great question. So tickets are, it's a free event. It's part of our commitment to make this available. So tickets can be gotten at the Fox Theater box office at 4 o'clock on the day of the lecture. 
So we have the Fox Seats 1200, so we have that many seats available. Everyone needs a ticket to enter, though. And so what we encourage people to do is come down, get their tickets, and then maybe stop and get some dinner or um, you know, refreshments. There's also a lot of great retail downtown now, so people can do shopping. So make it an event. Make it an evening. Well, Lydia, I'm sure after hearing a lecture all about food, they'll definitely <laughs> want to go eat something downtown. Thank you so much for sharing with us the College of People and all this great stuff that you're doing in the community. Thank Thank you so much for having me. The Downtown Lecture Series from the University of Arizona College of Social and Behavioral Sciences kicks off October 15th and runs through November 12th at the Fox Theater downtown. For a schedule of lectures, call 621-1112 or visit downtownlectureseries.org.arizona.edu.